OIF Vet here. Welcome back. Today we're going to be unboxing our brand new magazines. Now, if, if you've seen my other videos, you do know that I did get a Glock 44, which is the, uh, um, the 22 long rifle Glock, okay? Now, when I bought this, this was used. They're very hard to find right now. Um, I don't know why, because they weren't hard to find a few years ago. But they are right now. So I found one used and it came with a threaded barrel, which is what I wanted ultimately anyway. So I went ahead and picked it up. However, they only had a Pro Mag magazine with it. This is the only magazine that came with it. I hate Pro Mag. Uh, I just don't think they work very well and I cannot depend on them. This is just a practice gun, okay? I'm not using this on duty. I'm not using this for any special purpose. I'm just using it to practice. Uh, the threaded barrel because people sometimes are like why do you want or why do you want a suppressor on there well so you can go out there without earmuffs that's why quite frankly so today we're going to be opening the actual now these are the Glock um, 44 22 long rifle 10 round magazines these are the uh, the magazines that are supposed to come with the gun I bought them off of grabagun.com, uh, but you can find them anywhere. They're around the same price at all the places, uh, about 15 bucks each. And I'm gonna actually do a comparison video between the Pro Mag and the Glock magazines, uh, but I, I just wanted to kind of show you the unboxing today because I'm excited and I know you guys are too. So, it talks about their Glock heritage. If you really want to read that, go on their website. But uh, you can pause that and read that if you really want to. But like I said, it's Glock 44, 20, 22 long rifle, 10 round magazine. I got two of them. Now, right off the rip, I can tell that the Glock magazine is significantly heavier than the Pro Mag magazine. Uh, they look pretty dang similar, except for like the loading um, levers right here. The Pro Mags are kind of smaller. I don't know why why it feels so much heavier. Maybe it's just thicker composites or something like that. Maybe a different material. But until we do the compare and contrast video, the Pro Mag magazine is going over there. Oh yeah, so smooth, so smooth. That's nice. We like that. All right, so now we're gonna shoot it with this in there. And like I said, I am gonna do a video um, just to, and I do hate them. However, I will give them a fair chance in the video. So there you go. And now let's go shoot it. This is actually gonna be the end of this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, be, and turn your notifications on because we are going to be doing some giveaways. I don't want anybody to miss out. So turn your notifications on and also leave a comment, say hey, and uh, share the video, share the channel. That's how the channel grows. Uh, every week, I would like to put on content, whether it's just me unboxing a shipment of new magazines that I got for my new Glock um, or me changing out the sights of the Glock. Uh, the Glock 44 in my, I did get a brand new duty weapon. Um, so those two are going to be my main focus this year. That's, that's how kind of how I am in general. Like I will focus on my duty weapons, uh, and, and make sure I am super tight on that. Obviously this is not a duty weapon. Like I already said, this is for practice for duty. Um, but, uh, my duty weapon reflects, uh, this, pretty much and I want to make sure I got the same sights everything is exactly the same besides the fact that you know if I want to I would have a suppressor on this and that would be just for selfish reasons that I don't want to wear earmuffs and I want to be able to hear so there you go and and in real life situations I'm not going to be wearing earmuffs if uh if I if there is a shooting anyway on duty so I think that's pretty realistic so look for those videos um and I'm going today to look at some different guns 
So we may, you may see some new guns, brand new nice guns coming up. And uh, so look for those in ammo reviews. I love trying different ammos, what works the best per gun, especially this little guy. Um, so those videos are gonna be mixed in. Uh, also, I have a lot of cool stuff to shoot. I got a lot of neat stuff, different stuff that I just want to shoot. So those videos are gonna be coming uh, once a week. Uh, I'm gonna try to give you guys content. So make sure you look for that. Thank you, keep shooting.